Bus bar installation must be carried out by professionals. Wear safety helmets, insulating gloves, anti-smashing shoes, and other safety equipment. Prepare the necessary components and tools before installation. According to the design height, fix the hanger clamp on the on-site support and connect the hanger rod. Connect the data bus starting box to the suspension rod and tighten it with nuts. Remove the inner lining of the connecting component and place it in the groove above, below the straight section. Remove the bottom cover plate of the straight section of the bus bar and thread the top through the suspension rod. The protruding copper bar of the previous bus bar is embedded in another hole position. Lock the bolts at the connection of the bus bar face rail with nuts. Fix the top pay bus bar connection with bolts and nuts. Use an insulation resistance tester to determine that the insulation resistance between each phase is greater than 200 meters omega. Install the connecting components into the connection between the bus bars and tighten them with fasteners. Place the plug-in box at a 90 angle to the bus bar. The top elastic core is embedded at the bottom of the bus bar. And then rotate it clockwise by 90. Rotate the lower left corner of the plug-in box counterclockwise until the locking position is reached, and tighten the butterfly knot. Connect the electrical plug to the plug-in box to obtain power. Connect the RS485 signal lines of the monitoring system to the target terminal's starting box plug-in box separately. It can monitor corresponding parameters such as temperature rise, power consumption, and operation.